Gemini, this is Starbright. I was in the middle of doing your reading and it shut off on me. But what I had pulled three cards from the Psychic Oracle deck. And what I'm getting from you guys, this is going to be a reading for September the 18th, 2020. What I'm getting from these cards is some of you guys are having some kind of recognition and rewards. You got some kind of accomplishment. And you're going to have some kind of financial and material changes. What this cards are telling me, some of you guys are really putting some work in. And that you're going to gain some kind of financial uh, uh, reward and recognition. <laughs> You will have you're gonna get you gonna have a like financials and material changes. Some of you guys are looking good out there. You're making money. People are recognizing you. I'm quite sure you got some jealousy going on too. <laughs> All right. Spirit of the earth, water, fire, and air. What important messages for Gemini for September the 18th, 2020? What important messages for Gemini? What important messages? Any love, new love coming? Or is the old love trying to come back in? Uh, what what important messages does Gemini should know about September 18, 2020? <laughs> Somebody's feeling le left out in the cold. Could be a Leo. Somebody's in this energy. This is person is thinking about you. This person is thinking about all the good times that they had with you. This is someone that see you as someone who met who met their financial goal in life. But this person is the one who lets you go. Both can't be reversed. Tell me one, tell me one, tell me one. Now this person feeling a, a, a sense of loss about you because you're getting this financial, you know, this material and financial changes. <laughs> This person is making a decision about you. Could be a Libra. Uh, this is someone that's coming in that wants to balance things out with you. This is someone who puts you guys' relationship on hold. Now this person wants victory. <laughs> now they want to come in. They want to win at all costs because they see you as someone who's very grounded. They see you as someone very loyal. They see that you like nice things around you. Mm, this could be a, a, the, a, your... Uh, the mother, I mean, the father of your kids, or this is someone used to be married to this person, or this could be a Taurus, or someone of authority, or this person could be locked up. This person want to try to be hopeful. They want to pour all their emotions out to you because they want this brand new start with you. But this is so. This is someone that was holding back from you. Now this person feel burdened. Now, they, now this person coming in out serious now. Now this person can be controlling. Now they want to take action. They want positive changes now. This will be a Scorpio. Or this is someone that you had to end with this person. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. 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 Hmm. This is someone that is feeling sad. This is one trying to manifest you back into their life because they see you as their wish this person will live at a distance from you or this is someone that's acting distant toward you so your person is trying to make a decision make a decision and work on things with you because this, this is someone you could have been with for a long period of time or uh, this person see a uh, foundation with you stability with you a happy home with you this person see that you're very grounded they see that you are loyal they see that you are powerful male or female. This is someone that you had to end it with this person. This is someone that walked away from you. Now they're rushing in. Now they're trying to fight for your love. <laughs> fight for your attention. <laughs> now they want to come in. They want to give, uh, give and take. Now they want to commit. They want to come in. They want to speak the truth to you. They want to tell you exactly how they feel about you. They want to pour all their emotions out to you. This is someone that's coming in feeling their repercussions of their action because they did walk away from you. They end, they did end things with you. They did put your relationship on hold. Now they want to apologize to you, but it's a fish in this cup. They want something from you. The, the person, they see a loving family with you. The person is physically attracted to you. They see you as their twin flame. But that person is still holding on. That person is still holding on. They want this new start with you. 
You could have met this person at work or this person was in a third party. Hmm. Now this person wants to start something fresh and new, or fresh and passionate with you. Could be a Capricorn. Or somebody's in this toxic energy. This person been watching you. This person been gathering information about you. This person been stalking you. This is someone that took a long time. They're taking a long time to come in to, co to, to commit to you. Hmm. They might wait too late because they took so long. This is someone from your past. This is someone you could have kids with this person. This is someone that was hiding something from you. This is someone that had one foot in, one foot out. This person was not fully committed to you. Now this person is coming in trying to be patient because that person is married. Or this person coming in and wanting to marry you. This is someone who cut you out of their life and left you on hold. <laughs> This is someone you you could you plant your seed with this person. This is your ex. Now your ex is feeling sad. And now, now they want to come in and now they want to tell you the truth about their marriage. Hmm. This is the one that could have ghost you. Or this is a Virgo wants to come in and speak the truth to you. This is the one who broke your heart. Now this person is heartbroken. Now this person is feeling remorseful. Now, and this person see you as a good partner. This is the one who took a break from you. Because they see you as this king of pentacles. They see stability with you. They see a happy life with you. Because you're this king of pentacles. You just, you, this person see that you're, you, you're, you're advancing to the next stage. They see that you, you, you're, you're looking good. You're making money. You're standing out. This person see that. They see you as this king of pentacles. This is someone to see you as someone very abundant. You could be a male or female. You could be pregnant. That person see you as someone that will be a supporter. Now they want to come in. Now they want to sweep you off your feet. This is someone that betrayed you though. Hmm. Now they feeling betrayed. Because of somebody's in and out their life. This is who they had a reunion with this person. This person was a player. They betrayed you. Now they got betrayed. Hmm. This person was very deceitful. Whoever they had that reunion with this person, this person was very deceitful. <laughs> now they don't know how you feel about them. Because they do see you now as their soulmate. And they want to move forward with you. <laughs> this is someone who's very indecisive about you. This person could live across the water. This is someone that you had in the cycle with this person. This person see you as, it could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or a Gemini. Mm -hmm. This is someone that want to move forward with you. Or somebody's in this energy. They see you as someone flirty. They see you as someone needs uh, um like to be seen. <laughs> they see you as someone is a missed opportunity. This is someone that you had a lot of drama, arguments, and fights with this person. But now this person is trying to control their emotions about you. They're making a final decision about you. This person is sad. This person is so depressed about you. They want to send you this message. Hmm. But this person is arrogant. This person have a big ego. Let's see what spirit has to say about this. Spirit. Hmm. What do you have to say about this relationship? Hmm. Hmm. What advice do you have for Gemini? What advice do you have for Gemini spirit? What advice do you have for Gemini for September the 18th, 2020? What advice do you have for Gemini for this person coming in? What advice do you have for Gemini? <laughs> this a hold back. <laughs> hold back. Put it. Mm -mm. Put put the brakes on it. Because this person will burden you. This person is it says take action. Hold back because this person one that we're gonna burden you. It said take action. Because this person's still indecisive. About pouring all your emotions out to you. This person trying to manipulate you. Because they see you as they wish fulfillment. This is someone to live at a distance from you. A spirit said going to be some changes. Going to be a lot of fights and arguments and disagreements. Make a decision. 
and end things with this person. Because this person is very controlling. Spirit said you need to hold back. Person coming in, you need to hold back because this person is going to burden you. Take action because this person is still indecisive about you. That person coming in, they want to pour all their emotions out to you. But this person is trying to manipulate you because they see you as they wish. This is someone that live at a distance. Or this is someone that's acting distant. Spirit said going to be some changes. You're going to have a lot of fights and arguments. Make a decision to end things with this person. If you need a personal reading for me, the inf information down below in the description box, you could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sag, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. If you're new to my channel, hey, until next time, you guys.